Hey everyone, this is Steve with All Dogs Off-Road, and today we're going to be talking about your lower control arm bolts. This video is going to be specific to your 2nd gen Nissan Frontier, 2nd gen Nissan Xterra, and also the uh, R51 Pathfinder. So from the factory, the bolts that come on your lower control arms look just like this. They have a round washer, which is part of the bolt, and then a free washer, and then a nut. And this mounts, uh, this connects your lower control arms to the frame. So they basically, they mount at the pivot point of your lower control arms. So these are all well and good, except for the fact that there's no adjustability to these. So that is why um, we have something called a camber bolt. So a camber bolt at first looks very similar to a regular bolt, but once you take a closer look at it, you can see that the camber bolt has a slice down the side. I'll uh, zoom in a little bit on it. It's ground down so it's flat on one edge and then the rest of the bolt is, uh, is just normal. And the reasoning for this is the washers that come with it are a little bit different as well. The washers have the design of the bolt cut into them. So when you put them on, instead of a normal washer being able just to free spin, this is locked in with the bolt. So what that does is goes into your lower control on bushing. We'll just say that's it for, for argument's sake. It goes on connects, you know, all well and good. And when it's in, as you can see, it actually pushes the arm further this direction than this would, as you can see. Because the, the way that it mounts on the frame is it's retained between uh, between two notches right here, like that. So here it's also retained, but the bolt can rotate within this to adjust where the arm is in orientation to the mounting point. So basically, you go to the alignment rack, they get a, they get a wrench and they twist this and it pulls your arm um, in and out of the frame uh, and adjusts your camber and can adjust your caster. So, um, so that's a, a, a great part of it. Uh, really helps you dial in your alignment, especially after you've lifted a vehicle, which is um, which is extra important. And also helps you guarantee you know a long life out of your tires and keeps you driving straight on the road. Now, there's one new option that we've just very recently brought to market at All Dogs Off-Road, and that is something referred to as a cam bolt lockout kit or a cam bolt delete kit. So, as I said before, uh, these camber bolts are great. Um, they do have two downsides. The first downside of this is that when you're wheeling pretty hard and pretty heavy, um, we've sometimes seen that these can get just a little bit knocked out of alignment. So what you need to do afterwards is head back to that alignment rack, pay the 80, pay the hundred dollars, get that alignment redone so that you uh, track straight on the road and you can keep your alignment in the green. The other downside we've seen is that this usually happens on the alignment rack, but it can happen elsewhere is that when your alignment tech goes to adjust your cam bolts, he grabs, you know, he grabs his wrench and he really cranks on it. Sometimes we've seen that the inside of this washer actually gets opened up by the bolt. The bolt is a grade eight bolt, but the washers certainly are not. They, uh, they feel like it's a much cheaper steel and this bolt actually will round, um, this edge off here inside of the washer. Uh, and then your cam bolt no longer functions as a cam bolt. It functions just as a very normal bolt and you lose all of that alignment and it uh, causes you a lot of headaches. So our solution to that is called a cam bolt delete kit, which I mentioned earlier. 
The cam bolt delete kit is going to replace your cam bolts and it's going to come with four grade eight bolts, four washers, and it's going to come with Uh, da, 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 da. And it's going to come with these plates. It's going to come with 16 plates, eight lockout plates, and eight center plates. So basically, there's four more of this in the kit. So, what this does is similarly to how a cam bolt works where your bolt is offset on the washer the same thing is accomplished with these offset plates so you slide your bolt in and congratulations you have achieved the alignment aspect of a camber bolt but because Because these are rounded and these are not, you gain some strength because there's no, there's nothing fighting you in here like there is in here. So the, the way that this alignment works is that those notches that are on your frame, you slide these plates in and it locks them in here. So you have this setting, which is your arm all the way in you pull it out and you can rotate it to push your arm all the way out or you can replace it with this plate which centers the arm within the uh, within within its alignment abilities so this is a really really good option um, especially for the people who are wheeling hard there have been many times where I've been wheeling hard and I come home and my, uh, and my alignment is all out of whack and since putting these cam bolts in or these cam bolt delete kits uh, I have not had that issue we recommend these in conjunction with SPC upper control arms they pair together quite well because SPC arms still have the adjustability that you want and these uh, so you can lock these out and then still get that adjustability up top but they'll work with that just about anything you just got to take some time to play around with the different settings and make sure that you get your alignment where you want it. So, um, again, this is a very, very, very strong option. You'll be, you'd be hard pressed to have this setup fail. Um, while we we see cam bolts, uh, we see cam bolts fail more than you would think. Um, and it's just a, uh, it, it's a good setup for people who are uh, who are wheeling pretty hard. I will stress that this is definitely not for everybody. You know, if you're a daily driver, there's really no purpose to having this kit. But if you're out playing on the rocks, doing uh, doing some heavy wheeling, really really uh, moving that suspension around, this is a really solid option for you. Um, so this is on the site for I think it's either seventy or seventy five dollars for the set, which is around the price of uh, of cam bolts. Cam bolts are about sixty dollars for the set, so definitely um, worth looking into. If you're watching this video in November of 2020, we just announced our um, we just announced our Black Friday sale. So maybe go check that out, save some coin on a on a Campbell lockout kit. And uh, yeah, I'm going to toss up some pictures of how I have mine set up. My alignment stayed just great when I uh, when I threw these in and uh, definitely added that little bit of extra strength I was looking for. Um, all of the bolts and all of the plates that come in this kit are zinc plated, uh, so uh, really resistant to rust and they look quite nice as well. As always guys, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out, leave a comment, shoot us a message on Facebook or Instagram or whatever, uh, and we'll, uh, we'll do our best to get back to you. So thanks for watching, I hope you have a Good Black Friday, and I'll catch you later.